Comedy for you, Gomer, the ranting thespian. Put your hands together for our author. Good morning, everybody. Um, I've noticed that a lot of times I would get up on this stage and I would just immediately start singing, which obviously is not true this year. I know some of you are disappointed. But luckily, some people get to put away their earplugs for now, so they don't have to hear my voice. And I'm not, I don't really necessarily say I am a bad singer. But when I auditioned for the musical, I could see people putting cotton balls in their ears to stop the bleeding. <laughs> Which, in a way, it's a good thing for me because I actually have my own internet radio show now. And in doing that, I get to look up news stories that I otherwise would not have been motivated to do. Like this week, we're actually going to report out of New Zealand. There is a number one album out there, um, track, I'm sorry. I keep wanting to say album. And the good thing about this is it's only audible to dogs. <laughs> so when you have that in mind, you have to wonder, how does a, a, a single that is only audible to canines become number one? Well, I have a theory on this. Some guy went out and he decided he wanted to try something new. So he sees the track, okay, take it home, put it in a CD player. He spends about a minute listening to nothing but silence. And he is, as he is about ready to call the record company to complain about a busted CD, uh -huh. he sees his dog in the middle of the living room doing the Macarena. <laughs> and it just mesmerizes him for about a couple of minutes. And then all of a sudden the dog just goes back to sleep. And so he calls his friend Charlie instead. Hey Charlie, come over here and see this. So his friend Charlie comes over. And he puts the song on, this dog does the Macarena, and Charlie is just amazed, so he goes and tells all his friends, who go tells their friends, until every dog in New Zealand is doing the Macarena. <laughs> <laughs> and they want to market this in places like Australia and the United States. And when they market it over here, I'm going to be the first one to get one. I'm going to put it in my car, I'm going to turn the volume up as loud as I can, and every dog within a mile of my car is going to be dancing the Macarena. So you will know when I am coming. You'll just see a dog just start going, and it's like, yeah, go almost coming. Uh, thank you very much. Put your hands together for the Oakley ranting. You're good, Arthur. Thank you very much.